Hello, in this video let me show you how you are going to use the appraisal feature of Fluidbase HRM. On the left hand navigation menu click on appraisal. You will see this five links opening up. Click on training appraisal points. These are the training appraisal points that your employees have acquired by taking up the different trainings. Click on the employee ID to view the details of the employee and to view the points that the employee has acquired by taking different trainings you can view it out here. The next is employee engagement. Here you can actually add the employee of the month and then this employee that you add would be viewable by all your employees via the Luitbiz ESS module. To add an employee of the month click on the link add employee of the month select the company with which this uh, posting is related and fill out this three fields in the green section, the year, the month and the employee. If you want to put a congratulatory note for that particular employee which all other employees can see via the ESS module, you can do so by putting a note out here. So once you submit this form, all the employees uh, would be able to view the employee of the month via the ESS module of Luitbiz and you can view it out here. Of course you can make modifications by clicking on the uh, edit button against the name of the employee for that particular month and year. Next, employee goals and plans. The employee's goals and plans are set by their managers in the ESS module, but you can view the complete details of the goals and plans of the different employees by clicking on the view details button against the name of the employee. You can view the goals that has been set for the employee, the development plans that has been set for the employee, and the personal improvement plans of the PIPs that has been set for the employee for his, entire, his or her entire duration in your company by his or her manager out here. Then comes appraisals. There are three sections out here. One is employee appraisals. Here you can, of course, uh, clicking on the name of the emplo uh, employee ID, you can view the details of the employee. And uh, to view the different appraisals of the employee, you can either, uh, if you want to view the performance appraisal, you can click on the performance button against the name of the employee. Or if you want to view the 360 degree appraisals, you can uh, click on the 360 degree appraisal against the name of the employee. For example, if I want to view the performance appraisal of this particular employee, I go to this and then I select the appraisal period for which I want to view and I can actually view the complete details of the performance appraisal that has been added for this particular employee for this particular period. And if I want to view the 360 degree appraisals for this particular employee, I just have to select the appraisal period and then I can view the complete 360 degree appra uh, appraisals that has been taken uh, uh, for this, uh, has, that has been done for this particular employee for this particular period. Now if I want to start a 360 degree appraisal for a particular employee, I need to click on the start button against the name of the employee. I need to select the start date, end date and the appraisal due by and if I want to, uh, I need to add some comments and I need to select the appraisers. These appraisers could be their peers, um, their managers or anyone you like. You can select as many appraisers you like and click on the submit button. The moment you click on the submit button, all these appraisers would be notified that there's a 360 degree appraisal that they need to do and they need to log into their Luitbiz ESS and complete the appraisal. Now uh, the next link out here is new performance appraisals. So if you click on this, you can see that, uh, uh, you know, whose appraisal is being done, uh, by whom, and what's the score of the appraisal. If you want to view the complete details of the appraisal, click on view appraisal and you can view the complete details of the appraisal, including the employee's comments. And uh, if you feel that this is fine, you can go ahead and close the appraisal. Then next is new 360 degree appraisal. So once you start the 360 uh, degree appraisal, you'll keep on receiving the in, uh, inputs from the different appraisers and you can view the appraisals by clicking on the view appraisal button against the name of that particular employee. You can view the complete details of the appraisal that has uh, you know, um, been done, including the employee's comments on that. And then if you want to close the appraisal, just click on the orange button, close appraisal against the name of that employee and you can close that 360 degree appraisal against that appraiser. Now, once this whole appraisals are done, you can actually view a whole bunch of appraisal reports. You can view goal reports. You just need to select the employee whose goal reports you want to view and you can view the reports of the employee both in text and graphical format. Similarly, you can view the development plan reports, the pers personal improvement plan reports, the performance reports and the 360 degree appraisal reports for all the employees in both text and in graphical format. So that's how you manage the appraisal feature of Fluidbiz HRM. 
Thank you for watching.